Hello everybody, this is Drew Naylor, and today I'm going to be doing a video tutorial on how to take the um, Premiere Pro title templates. Uh, no, I mean the a Premiere Pro text style, and then turn it into a template so that you can apply it later. So what you want to do is you want to go over here, you want to go to the Premiere Pro titler, and somehow... I'm just going to name this Z so that I can find it again easily. And then we're going to put some, put the text thing right here. I don't know why it keeps going over like that. Take the text thing and then type in whatever you want. And then you, you can highlight it or you don't have to. And then over here you can change it however you want. So I want to make it something crazy like a 44 degree slant. Um, increase the tracking, change the aspect, I don't really know, I'm just trying to give it some crazy stuff. Let's give it a white shadow, so it's, so you can see it. And then change a few things. This isn't supposed to really look good or anything. Change this. Have that like that. Have an offset of this. Actually, bevel. Let's bevel it. Shadow color can be this. That should make it look pretty good. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing with this. Um. Oh, that's the highlight. Okay. Okay. This kind of looks really weird, but this is to just demonstrate what um, can be done. Now I want to highlight all of it, change it to... Mm, let's change it to bold and underline it. Then italicize it. Then make text bigger. Make the text bigger. Yeah. Maybe not that big. There we go. That works. And also change this to the best font of all time. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> now, what you want to do is go down here, right click, choose new style. Um, we can just name it, um, the worst possible font style ever created. Delete me. There we go. Now we have this. And if you want to click on something else, it changes it to something that looks much better. And then we can change it back to this. If we wanted to for some reason. Don't know why you would, but it's there. You can also move these around, so if this is a super important font, you can put it right at the beginning. Or if you want an actually good font, oh, you have to click on it. You can use like this one. This one's my regular text font. If you want something that kind of looks like Luigi's Mansion dialogue, well, I, I did this. Then it can be like this. So I would be make the one making it look like Luigi's Mansion dialogue. But yeah, so now you can have this anywhere you want. And now if you want to, if you close it, add a new title. Throw in some text. And now you can change it. Ta-da! I hope this helps anybody that was trying to figure it out. Goodbye for now.